Hey, good evening, WildCC family. Johnny Dew here, I hope you guys are doing good. If you own a phone at all, you probably got a, a message today in regards to the restriction of all non-essential movement in, because of the COVID-19 outburst. I wanted to take a moment and encourage you guys to be smart. Ask the Holy Spirit, who is the creator of the human body and everything that we can see. Say, Lord, help me to, to make wise choices for not only my health, but for the health of our brothers and sisters. Be conscientious that the world is a little bit bigger than just what's around you. And we want you guys to join us this Sunday, but to do so with that same kind of mindset of caring for one another, to come wearing a mask. I mean, there should be nothing that stops us from gathering together as the body of Christ and to enjoy the benefits of our communion with one another and with Jesus. But we ask you to wear a mask, to be conscious that there are those, um, like many people that I care about, that have a weaker immune system and that this disease is no joke to. We know it's an inconvenience and a lot of you guys are very anti-mask, but we ask you to be pro-family and pro-body of Christ and let's do whatever we can to keep our doors open because that's the end goal is it to continue to meet. And if we have to put on a mask or wash our hands a couple extra times or maybe spread the seats out a little bit further, man, we want to do whatever it takes to keep those doors open. Why? Because this is the season of hope. Jesus Christ came down, put on flesh, God incarnate. What a crazy thought. I mean, think about that. Like, it's literally unheard of previous to Jesus coming in and flipping the whole world <laughs> upside down. Think about it, man. Jesus loved you enough to do whatever it took to invite you into his family, to give you a seat at his table. And this Sunday, December 13th, we are going to have one service only, and that's at 10 a.m. And we are going to celebrate and worship God together through the help and the leadership of our young people, through our children's ministry, our um, after-school enrichment program, our preschool, and then our youth will lead us in worship, and then Pastor Mike will close us with a devotional. And we want to invite you guys to come and join us this Sunday, December 13th at 10 a.m. to worship God, who is the Prince of Peace, the wonderful counselor, Emmanuel, God with us, God with me, and God with you. We love you guys, and we'll see you then. Welcome anymore